All right, boom. So this is officially the last video of this channel. You know what I mean? Shout out. We got to let Bowser have a feature on here with the fire, bro. You know? And now, the battery, the battery, the battery, the battery dead on this shit. Ain't no water. All right, cool. Well, this last video of this channel, man, I got to uh, I'm not technically going a uh, hundred percent away from uh, doing this crap, but you know, uh, this is putting a, a dent on my book selling. A lot of people, I've been getting a lot of complaints. You know, and people uh, like you know, they find me on Amazon Kindle, they read my books, they Google Professor Joe Casey, and before any of the other stuff they want to see pop up, this book stuff. I mean, this video game stuff pop up. So it's creating a conflict of interest. You feel me? It's creating a conflict of interest. So uh, we're going to start a whole different channel. I got to get as far away from the Professor Joe Casey brand with this video gaming that I possibly can. Now, when I start this new channel, if you guys, you know, uh, want to see this new channel be successful, I'm going to need you guys to support it. I'm gonna need you guys to, you know, get on this $1 cash app, $1 PayPal, $1 Patreon, you feel me? Uh, support this thing, man, because I, I take away from my books when I do this. I take away from uh, my writing when I do this. I take away from my Patreon where I, I, I teach off lessons of my books when I do this. So this is a labor of love when I come on here and I do these video games. Uh, content for you guys. Now, if you guys don't want to support it, you know, you got Metal G's, you got all the mother cats, man. Knock yourself out, man. You know, hey, y'all don't need Professor Joe Casey in the video game management, uh, whatever this shit is called. Y'all don't need me over here. And I, 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 I'm I, perfectly fine with stepping away and just playing my video games in peace. To be real with you. So I'm just letting that be known. So we finna put out this next video game channel. I'm gonna leave the link in the description. I'm gonna make the channel before I even upload this thing yet, man. And I want you guys to support it. I'll put out a couple of more videos on this channel. I'm finna completely change the name of the channel once again. I know y'all hate when I change the name, but y'all y'all will be A-OK. -okay. This is about my money here. I'm, try <laughs> I'm trying to have some damn money at the end of the day. So, uh, I went over my whole Switch collections of 200 games. 200 Switch games. I'm down to my last 60 that I had to go through. And uh, I'm finna give you guys 10 out of this that you guys might really want to be on the lookout for. Uh, Switch, Switch don't put out so many games. It's, it's ridiculous, bro. The Switch don't put out so many freaking games. It's, it's like, it's, it's really ridiculous. I don't see, I don't see, uh, I don't see anybody having a really hard time collecting Switch games and having a, a collection that's going to be worth something. It's kind of like the PS, PS4. Just if you see it cheap, I just say buy it. Don't, don't let nobody tell you, oh, buy this game here, buy that game now. I'm just doing this to let you know if you have this in your collection, then you might have something that's valuable. I'm not making no recommendations on anybody should pick out this game or somebody should pick out this game. All my recommendations stem from buy cheap, buy cheap. And if you look up one day and you don't bought something cheap and it turned out to be something good, they good for you. But that's 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 pretty much the, the short and long of what I recommend. Man. I don't I don't put nothing out there and say gotta buy this, gotta buy that. So this is a pretty much uh if you got this in your collection, you're pretty much good type of video. You know, so we're gonna start it off with the basics and let's get to it. Now this might be crazy. <laughs> I don't think this game is gonna be uh wear no shape, form, or fashion, but this is a pretty damn good game. If you got this in your collection, then you pretty much you you good man. You know, you pretty much good if you got this in your collection. Princess Peach, Showtime, uh if you ever played Puppet Tail on PS3, this is gonna kind of remind you of that. This like it's like they literally somebody from Nintendo played Puppet Tail and said, "Okay, I got a game for Princess Peach." And uh, you know, like it's a hit. My kids love this game, man. Princess Peach Showtime. Uh, 
Not a rare game, not a rare game by a long stretch, but definitely something I think people should consider putting in their collection. Uh, I'm gonna go through another obvious game that might not be so rare, but people are treating it like it's rare. Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Thing already selling over 100 on eBay, man. Thing is already selling over 100. You're not gonna find a copy of this. It's gonna be real hard to find a copy of this thing sell without paying 100 dollars right now. So, you know what I mean? Uh, I had to go and buy an extra copy pre-owned so I could have me a copy that uh, my kids could play, but it is what it is, man. Uh, so, that, another game I already talked, I talked about this game before, Cadence of Hyrule. If you got this in your collection, then uh, you might be pretty good, man. Uh, Zelda, uh, a Zelda rhythm dance game. So, I mean, hey, if you got that, pretty good. Another game I spoke on before, Chronos Before the Ashes. See, I buy these games on the 4 for 40, man, when they are uh, $10. If you got that, you know, uh, that's something I don't, I don't never see that game. I don't never see that game. Deadly Premonition. Deadly Premonition, uh, I think that's part two, ain't it? Deadly Premonition 2, A Blessing in the Skies. It's a hard running game on Nintendo Switch. Most of the Nintendo Switch games are horrible running, so. But if you got Daily Premonition, then you're pretty good. Uh, that's a pretty good game to have. That's going to be a, uh, that, that's, it's already hard to find. So, I mean, if you got that, I, I think you're straight. Uh, Tiny Barbarian, DX. Talked about that before. Send more, EX. I talked about that before. It's a smoke game. Flashback. If you got that in your collection, I think you're going to be good if you got a game like Flashback in your collection. Uh, Blade. Blade or something. This game, I don't I don't know how old this game is, but it's, it's still up there at around $30. Completed, completing box. Now, of course, you know, games start trying to sell it to me for new. How much I paid? I know I didn't pay $34 for it. I got to go back and see how much I paid for that. I think I paid like $15 or something for it. I don't know. Uh, the Binding of Isaacs. It's two prints. It's a two print game. Where the other print at? I got another print. And I had an interesting story with that, man. Cause I was trying to, I was trying to get that, I was trying to get that jokes, uh, I was trying to take one of the Joseph's bike, the GameStop, because I, I had bought the other one on, online. It was two of them that came out, right? I had bought the, I, I, had, I had both prints. So I got the other print offline, and I wanted to take the the, the open one I had bite the GameStop. But the shotty, shotty that came over to my house and called us up cleaning up. And I guess she threw out my GameStop receipt or something. I don't know, man. I just, I couldn't find my GameStop receipt after her goofy and I cleaned my house. And so I'm stuck with a, I got a whole, I got a, I got a Hall of Fame version. I got a Hall of Shame version of Bison, got a, a Bison of Isaac uh, that I just, I might give that shit away. I might give it away, man. Like I say, man, it's that up because I wanted to start doing free game giveaways once this channel hit a thousand, this channel, that's another reason why I got to close the channel. I, I've been doing the channel three years. This channel ain't hit a thousand subs yet. And it's hurting the book writing business. So it's like, damn, like, I could see if, you know, it was hurting the book writing business, but it was also doing great over here. Then maybe it'll, it'll you know, even itself out. But nah, man, you, I can't be, I can't be crashing over here and it's hurting the book writing business. And that, that's, that's a double negative, bro. So, some, some got to give. So, you know, uh, I appreciate everybody for vibing with me over here. I appreciate everything y'all done, man. I appreciate all the likes and comments. Y'all yeah, got to let this shit rap. You feel me? I got to switch it up. So what you got to do in life, man? When stuff ain't working for how you need to work it, you got to switch it up. You got that end is not another good game, man, that a lot of people are sleeping on. Right there. You got two other games, so man. Let me get these two other games. I was going 
I was gonna leave them out, but us, I gotta put these two games in. You know, if you got these two games in your collection, and yours, if you don't got them, don't don't trip. But if you got them, you good. Astro Chain, great game to have in your collection, man. Great game to have in your collection. Uh, Maglum Lord, another great game to have in your collection. If you got it, if you don't got it, don't worry about it. You know, if you don't got it, don't worry about it. It ain't the end of the world. You ain't got to go out and spend $30 trying to get that shit. You see what I'm saying? That was a lot, this was a lot of dumbness to do. You ain't got to go out and, and put no extra money on your credit card. Oh, shit, I don't got Maglum. Oh, I need Maglum. Oh, I need uh, all this. Nah, man. If you don't got it, you don't got it. That's it. You know what I'm saying? But Maglum, Lord, that's a good game, man. Just, I would say... You know, uh, we all know GameStop getting ready to have another sale. Just, you know, go online and that should be the first thing you search up. Close to the sun. Oh, that's another good one. I think going to be, uh, I just, this, this just me giving my opinion. I could be wrong. All these games can, can turn out to be worth jack shit in 10 years. Who knows? But I'm just saying, like, if you got it, it's a good game to have in your collection. If you don't got it, I want to go out and just buy it for somebody for $30 or shit like that. I will wait for another GameStop sale. And like day one of that sale, I'll be searching. The Persistence, another great game, man. I, I would recommend somebody to have in their collection. Here's one that I don't think a lot of people are going to talk about. AEW Fight Forever. I don't think this game was received good. I don't hear uh, too many wrestling fans talking about it. Uh, it, it probably so well. I don't. I just don't think it is. I just because I just I, I ain't even know the shit was out till I you know came across you know what I mean on on, on the game stuff. That. That's, that's like I do that with a lot of games, bro. A lot of games I don't even be knowing them. them shit be out, bro. Till I see them on sale, like game stuff, bro. It's crazy, but it is what it is with, with that. You feel me? Uh, I already talked about slaying fight from hell. You know. If you got that in your collection, that's a good game. It's a great game to have in your collection. Uh, I already talked about Cave Store. Great game to have in your collection if you got it. Uh, here's one that I need to get the case for. Team Sonic. Team Sonic. Uh, it's a double pack. It's Team Sonic and it's Sonic Mania on the same car. I need to get the regular case for this. But GameStop got a team Sonic race, but it's it's a double car. That's that's a good that's a good game I think to have in your collection. Borderlands, I think I already showed y'all Borderlands today. That's a good game to have in y'all collection. Uh, another game that might be rare. I don't know. That Sonic Origins. The Sonic Origins. I think that's a good game to have in your collection. Uh, I'm not even gonna show y'all no Pokemon Double Pack Plus. I think anybody, anytime you see a, a Pokemon Double Pack, you should probably pick it up. But here's one. I don't know if we're gonna complete this because I'm starting to notice there's a lot of Nintendo Switch games at GameStop that don't have no damn cases. It, it's getting hard to find Nintendo Switch games in good condition. That's, and that's surprising to me. This early, well, nah, Nintendo Switch been out seven years, so. It ain't early in the life cycle of the system. But, you know, uh, it, it is kind of early for a phase out, you know, because normally games don't start getting trash in trash conditions. Like, you start seeing them everywhere trashed out for a system to, like, system them and discontinue for at least, like, two years. Man, I've been seeing this issue with GameStop for the longest, for the last four years. I've been noticing a lot of Hall of Shame versions of GameStop games. Now, I got this for the Switch. I got the Collect Edition for the Switch. The, um, not, not for the Switch, for the Vita. This is the soundtrack it comes with. This game is pretty valuable on the Vita, too. I think it's going to be valuable on the Switch as well. Uh, I'm looking for a complete case for it, so I definitely could recommend you guys be on the lookout for Death Mark. If you can find it. But yeah, man, that's all I got, man. I'm going to get up out of here, man. I appreciate everybody for, you know, rocking with me on this journey. Uh, if you guys don't follow me over to the next channel, 
I just want to thank you in advance. Uh, if you guys going to end your journey with me here, then I appreciate everything that, you know, y'all was with me on. Appreciate all the love. I appreciate the support y'all gave me. And I just hope y'all understand, man, you know, uh, why I'm doing what I'm doing and how I'm doing uh, what I'm doing, man. And, uh, you know, uh, I just appreciate you. And, and if you support me, go on Amazon and give my books some ratings, man. Go on Amazon and rate my books, man. It's free on Amazon account. It's free. But y'all be cool in the stool. I'm staying there because of the two peas in the pot. Thank you. And the stove ain't hot. I'm going to go case it. I'll holler at you.